One of the things that I learned how to do when I taught at colleges was um, find a way to make your students stronger, stronger than they were. And I used to remember that when I would meet my English classes to begin with, the thing they were always most afraid of was poetry and having to interpret things and having to write papers about that. It really scared them. It was um, poetry, particularly scared them and as beautiful as it was that it kind of broke my heart but I also realized that they were afraid of that assignment so over the course of a year what I did is I always put that assignment first it was always the first thing that we did so reading poetry and learning to interpret it and writing papers about it working them through that process was always the first thing that I did in the course of a term and I always did that because I wanted to teach them right away that they could do something they didn't think they were capable of. Something that they thought was going to be the hardest didn't turn out to be the hardest. And to, to get them to the point where they would do something significant right off the bat that they would get a better grade than they ever would have expected on. And that always, um, that always served us well. And then what I would do is I would graduate everything up through that pyramid so that at the end my hope was that they were both thinking and writing for themselves because they I tried to set them free in the very beginning and um, so I, I think I just want to say that only to say um, maybe the thing that can make you strongest is something that um, you don't think you're going to succeed at and so maybe now is the time to buckle down and figure out that you actually can do it and you can succeed at something that you have on the back burner and for me for the last couple of years I have played small and um, uh, I think I no longer want to do that and I think that I'm not going to put forward in business anything that I don't want to be anymore and um, that's going to be hard but that's that's what I'm going to do that's my next assignment over the next two to three months to set my prices where I know that they are supposed to be because it's been divinely given to me and to pursue that and to package myself just as who I know that I'm supposed to be and make that hump over what I don't think people are going to accept or appreciate or something that I'm afraid I won't be able to pull off. So that's my um, pledge to myself over the next two to three months is to transform into exactly what I know I should be and to raise the curve for myself because I know I can jump over it, which is why it's the curve. So that's how you master the curve, right? Um, and do it good. So wish me luck. Thanks.